Good morning, everybody. We spent the night last night at the Love's Gas Station, so we got our tanks dumped for 10 bucks. so that was a good thing. Uh, we got up and got going early then, went on to Williams, Arizona, which is where we are now. That's the Grand Canyon train you just saw there on the right-hand side. Now this is a little shot of Williams. That's where we did our laundry this morning. We're just getting done, about ready to get back on the road. Go 
slow. That old bull is some cow's bow. seen the thing say though so they must have that. a they must have a hydrant here somewhere for RVs for RVs let's go in and find out
Good Sam Campground. Dope on a rope. Dope on a rope. Uh, so apparently this guy, Walter Peck, and his horse fell into this opening in the ground, um, which he later discovered, which this was this cavern. So he used to charge a fee to lower people, of all things, on a rope, and it was 200 plus feet down there, and he'd give them a lantern to go explore. So that's how he was making his money. Um, thus the dope on a rope thing, that, that's where that came from. Um, there's different tours. Uh, we're just going to do the standard tour in a minute here, and um, you'll see that. But in uh, this is a privately owned caverns, and in 1962 they did rename it into the Grand Canyon Caverns. Um, but also in 1962 there was the Cuban Missile Crisis, so the U.S. government designated all the caverns as fallout shelters, and you'll notice the fallout shelter sign on that um, elevator above it. Um, anyways, they, they made the fallout sh shelter for up to 2,000 people, and then they supplied it. And as it turns out, those supplies are still in the, in the caverns, and you'll see that. At any rate, it's 210 feet below the surface that we go down in that elevator that they say is tested and checked once every week, or once every two weeks, Scott? Once every two weeks, yeah. Um, and it's one of the largest dry caverns in the United States. And because of that, there's hardly any stalactites or stalagmites in there because of the lack of water. But uh, they didn't allow videos, so this is one of Scott's montages. Enjoy it. Here it comes. I never made it, but I know what it takes. I'm motivated by a mix of emotion. Got my statement, and I'm reading. So I can understand it fully Appreciate my standing Go out of this world And right on time Oh, never in my life Have I seen the sky light up like this I'm far away from Earth And I wanna know if you exist Mission Control Another reason to breathe this air And now we may fall 